Hi guys, I hope everybody is okay. Uh, let me just dial this down a little bit. So, uh, yep, yeah, I hope everyone's okay. We've been off for a little bit. We'll explain why uh, very, very soon. Are you all, are you all good, Shaw? I'm good. Are you all right, John? I'm all good. So, uh, guys, you'll notice that we're uh, just on Facebook for the time being. Uh, we're not streaming out to YouTube uh, because we've actually changed our software that we're using. Uh, we haven't done a live for a while, and I thought I'd, uh, it'd be a good idea to change the software that we're running. And then I said to Charlene this morning, let's do a live and then realize that I hadn't set any of the software up. So uh, bear with us. I hope that everything is good uh, and that we are live yeah, we are. Uh, and that everything's good. Now, the only thing is can that I can't... Can you can everybody yeah, hear us? That's the problem. Can you just let us know? Now, there's one thing that I can't do, and that is uh, bring you your guys' chat uh, into the stream right now. Uh, I, as I say, I'm working on it. Uh, but yeah, so moving forward, the reason why, guys, we have uh, we haven't done a live uh, for a little bit, and it is our apologies that we haven't, um, is because, Charlene, what has happened? Well, I, my dream's come true <laughs> after six years, I finally got a new kitchen. Okay, <laughs> so the most of you are probably aware, uh, our studio's at home, uh, so, uh, unfortunately, due to the amount of work that's gone into this kitchen, there is walls that have been knocked down and everything. Lots of dust. So, we have basically I had to pack all the gear and everything away to make sure that nothing got damaged. Uh, and so, the, uh, the, the last piece went in uh, on last Friday. Uh, so, uh, we frantically cleaned up, we put the studio back, and here we are with a live. So guys, thank you so much for joining us. Uh, well, let's talk a little bit about a few things uh, you know today's... What's been happening, John? There's been a fair bit. In the bit. world of magic. In the world of magic. Uh, well, we've got a little... Uh, we've actually got a couple of new uh, products that we've got in as exclusives, which yeah. we'll talk about. Uh, but also, uh, and I'm glad you've reminded me, Charlene, because... Uh, I wanted to talk about the flash paper. Yeah. Now, guys, just in case uh, you, you, you're unsure, you're unaware of sort of what's been uh, really good quality flash paper and where to get it from, we can only ship this uh, domestically uh, due to it being a hazardous product. But uh, we've, we've got... An, now, this is only a small portion, by the way, of flash paper. Of flash paper but we've got the premium, premium sparkle sparkle thick and thin thin's the most popular uh and uh if you go on to the description of the flash paper all home branded as well all global mass yeah so we we took we took great pride uh in the with the with the supplier uh who supplies us with this it really is the the, the finest that you can get uh we've also got uh flash cards flash corks so, which is great for an event where you can actually put one of these flash corks in, light it, and the cork just whoosh, goes up like that. It looks really, very really good. Very popular, yeah. Uh, and the the sparkle is very popular as yeah. well, isn't it? Yeah. It looks that looks really, really good. Uh, the burn rate on all these is exceptional, uh, and the quality is just as as always, guys. Is a one. It took us years, believe it or not. Uh, the amount of problems I had to try and get flash paper into Australia and then ship it was an honestly was a nightmare uh, and we really have located the, the finest stuff now so uh, if you don't have it and you're after flash paper make sure you check it out at Global Magic Shop uh, with the flash paper and I think they're actually on the home page as well now uh, if you just click on all flash products they're all there yep. in one category uh, so Charlene uh, I thought let's uh, I thought I'd share with this. I, I haven't seen that. Haven't you? No. This this is really good. I'm not sure. Have you seen the other? Have you seen this one? Shelby Wallace. Yeah. No, I haven't actually. Okay. So uh, everything that we've got, uh, I'm going to show you and talk about. Uh, we've got here uh, available to ship immediately. Uh, the reason why I'm going to show all of these is uh, I think that these are really really good. So I'm going to play the trailer uh, to my poker collection. Uh, so you can actually see what it's about, and then we'll talk a little bit about it. Uh, so here, without further ado, is My Poker Collection by Martin Brazesis. Has ever pronounced that right? Brazesis. <laughs> this guy. Yeah. 
I love playing poker and collecting the cards from my most important games. My lucky card is the Ten of Spades. With these cards, I won a lot of money. I will share to you how to do it. Hey, Kelly, how are you? Good, how are you? Very, very good. I'm going to tell you a secret. Oh, okay. I play poker for money. And I cheat. <laughs> what? Do you want to see how? Of course, yes. Look, here I have a bunch of ten of space. You can see ten of space, ten of space, ten of space. Mm -hmm. I only have to go like this. And now one turns face down, look. Mm. I can beat it. I go like this. And now two are face up. And two are face down. Mm. Very, very slow, face to face. I will have to go like this. And now all of them oh. are face down. I don't know why. Why? Because it's easier for me to change them into a royal flash. Jack, queen, king, and of course, ace. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> nice, right? That's awesome. Please. So guys, that is my poker collection. Now, uh, Charlene has actually just seen this for the first time. We so saw. Busy. So, so busy getting all these <laughs> He's out. out. I haven't even seen it. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Charlene's actually just said, this is such a me kind of trick. And she's absolutely right. I absolutely love this kind of magic. Uh, there's very little work involved uh, with this to make it uh, play really, really strong. Uh, there's, there's very little moves in here. They're very basic. Uh, and it's really good. It's a bit of eye candy. I think it's very startling at the end. You know, you've they, they've clearly seen all 10 of spades and then you produce the royal flush it's absolutely killer if you don't have this i do recommend this this is this has been very popular uh, this and the shelby wallet uh, are the more recent additions that have uh, come on and come into the website and into the shop uh, but very 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 good uh, i probably will have a good play with this uh, later on uh, but you, and of course you get everything you get all the cards all the online tutorial, everything's in here. It's really, really good. What do you think, Sean? Uh, well, it explains why it's been so popular. Yeah, it, it really is very, very good. Very simple, very easy to do, uh, and you get you get a lot of uh, a lot of bang for for what really mm. you're doing. Uh, by the way, um, the creator of this is the creator of uh, an, another effect that I really liked, which was called uh, Defaced, which was brought out by mm. Penguin. Uh, if you jump onto the website, Defaced is actually, uh, I think, I think there's, a, there's a sale, so there's a discount on Defaced. Make sure you go over and you check that out. Uh, check My Poker Collection and Defaced. He's a very, very clever thinker. Really, really good. So uh, that is My Poker Collection. I thought that was... Can I just add, you did mention the sale. So we do have a tax time sale on at the moment because it is... I do. End of we do. The financial year. Yes. In Australia. So we have got a, a sale on at the moment and things, products are heavily discounted. So take advantage. Yep. Yep. And get what you need. Yep, 100%. Uh, now, uh, I've just realised that I've removed that from the home page, oh. the, the sale. So straight after here, I will actually put that back on so you don't have to search for anything. It'll be on our home page and it'll say, uh, end of financial year sale or something like that, but it'll be basically there underneath the trending now uh, products on the homepage of the website. So I'll do that. So there's, pl there's plenty of products really, and there's guys, just because they're on sale, by the way, these are really, really good products that, we, that we've heavily discounted uh, due to the end of financial year sale. And it also frees up, to be honest with you, some cash flow for us so we can continue buying uh, there's the exclusives. More, some more products coming out next yep. month. Yep. And the month after that, we've had a look at, and they look pretty mind blowing. Yeah, they're really, really good. Uh, in fact, they, there's going to be one. I, I can't. I, I won't say what it Stop is. Stop it. Uh, but what, it, what are you saying? The, but it's uh, from one? from Magic Dream. So I can't say any more than that, Charlene. Oh, yes. Yeah. Okay. So. Uh, what we ordered. So. <laughs> So that's, they're, they're, they're on the way to us. So when we can uh, go live uh, as a launch, which is gonna, I think the release date for this particular product is the 4th, 
of next month. That's when I'm allowed to advertise it. So brace yourselves because it's going to be an amazing utility device oh, yeah. that uh, is, is really good. But I'm saying no more now. I'll get myself into trouble. So, uh, so guys, that was my poker collection. Uh, it's cold, isn't it? Well, to be honest, <laughs> it's maybe freezing. Freezing. Bomb. I'm pretty rugged up <laughs> so today, every and the weather is just <laughs> dropped. Uh, we're in winter now in Perth, and <laughs> I truly believe every winter gets colder. Yeah, like just before we went on to the live, I was actually uh, being really manly and chopping wood up in the back uh, and getting the fire on yeah. for the dog. For the dog, yeah. <laughs> She's shivering. <laughs> So at least, at least the fire will be on ready for the boys and to come back. she won't come to us because normally she likes to make an appearance on the live, doesn't she? Yeah. But she's not going to come to us because she's too busy sitting in front of the fire. <laughs> she really is, guys. <laughs> uh, so I just want to say hello to everybody that's joining us. Uh, so obviously we, we can only see what we've got here. But uh, I know that Damo's on, uh, Steve's on, uh, Gerard's on, uh, uh, Dave's on. So guys, thank you so much for, for joining us uh, for this live. Uh, apologies again, but we're back into the flow of things now. So the next Shelby thing... Shelby wallet. Let's look at the Shelby wallet. Now, this shout, the, so the next product is by Mark Mason uh, and Gaz Lawrence. Uh, it is the Shelby wallet. Now, there's been, there's been a lot of hype about this product and... I literally only have a few left from this batch. I don't even know if Murphy, I might be wrong here. I'm not sure if they've sold out. It wouldn't be surprised if they have, if Murphy's have sold out. There's been a lot of hype. Uh, essentially, this is a peak wallet. Uh, and the peak is ridiculously, ridiculously clear. It's very, very clean. I'm gonna play the trailer for this and we'll discuss it a bit in a bit more detail and we'll go over a, a few more things. So, it's a blinding peak. He's <laughs> Mark Mason, he's just, he's, he's just a genius. Right, so, Shelby Wallet, here we go. Oh my God! No! I got Boomer. Tommy? Is that it? Yeah. Tommy. Jesse. This is the Shelby Wallet by Gas Lawrence. Anything at all that your spectators can think of, a word, a name, a drawing, anything at all. You can show the wallet on every single side, yet when you put it in their hands or you put it away in your pocket, you already have the peak. So let me ask you this, did you catch both times that I peaked the information? Crafted from the finest leather, the small credit card holder will allow you to peek any word, number, symbol, or picture. Tell me when you're finished, and we're just gonna place it here in my wallet. I just want you to think of this word. Do you think that's a harder or an easier word to get? I think that's a harder word to get. What, what, what was that? Boomer. Boomer? Oh my God! <laughs> no! <laughs> I got Boomer. Wow, I can't believe you did that. The design is so unique and the principle is so clever, you will blow your audience's minds. This is the fairest, easiest, cleanest method I've seen. No questions, no electronics, no privacy glass, no lights. I predict you will love the Shelby wallet. And that is the Shelby wallet. Um, now, the peak is so, so clear. Uh, so it's, it's an effect by Gaz Lawrence and Mark Mason has produced it. The quality of the wallet is exceptional. It's a very modern looking wallet, if you, as you've seen in the, in like the, the, the trailer. Wallet. Yeah, yeah, which is, by the way, is the I still use, I've got it in my pocket. There we go. That's my, that's my contactless uh, wallet by Alakazam Magic. That's my uh, part of my everyday carry. Um, 
this is, it's great. It does exactly what you have seen. And the peak is lightning fast. And as I say, it is super clear. Uh, you get a full peak, so it's a full look at it. Uh, there are no lighting restrictions or anything like that. It's just ridiculously clean. Charlene doesn't know the method to this, no. uh, uh, but I'm going to show her uh, after this live. Well, it's dead easy. Yeah, and, and it is. It's, it, it is ridiculously oh, easy to then. get the peak, <laughs> and it's just so clean and clear. Uh, he's really, really made an exceptional job. He deserves the hype and the credit for this because... Uh, it really is a fan. If you're after a peak wallet, uh, and that's what this is, it won't do anything else. Uh, although you could put other everyday carry uh, items in there if you wanted to, because it is a wallet, um, you will uh, you you you'd be hard past hard pressed to go past this Shelby wallet if if you're after a peak mm. device. And it's not that badly priced either. No, 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 no. And the quality of the wallet. Uh, Which explains the why it's been so popular. Yeah. Because remember the weekend, I think it came out last weekend. Yes, yep, that's right. And the website went crazy. Yeah, over the o over, over over these, these two. two. This was the Shelby wallet was released on the Saturday morning for us. So American was 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 uh, three o'clock in the afternoon on a Friday. Uh, which is or midday, sorry, which is about three o'clock on Saturday morning for us. Uh, in Perth, Australia, so that got released, and then on uh, Monday's release was uh, was my poker collection. Both very, very good, super easy to do. It does what it says on the tin. You, if you want a peak wallet, you won't be disappointed with the Shelby wallet. Exceptional. Well done, Gaz Lawrence and Mark Mason. Very, very good. Uh, so we've got those available to ship right now. Uh, what else has been going on, Charlene? Anything much? Oh, we, we've added a, a few more. Uh, I added another blog uh, to the website as well, guys. So make sure you go. Uh, it's up on the home page when you scroll through. Uh, at the very top, sorry, uh, where it, uh, I can't even remember what it says at the top of our, of our website. But it's the, there is a section called blogs. Click on there. And the latest one is always uh, the, the first one that you'll, that you'll see. Uh, but there's a heap on there as well. I'll tell you what happened over the, the time. A couple two or three weeks ago, we received our huge order of uh, Apparition and yep. Mirage coin sets. Yep. And Knock 'em Dead. Knock 'em Dead, and, yep. And some other Alakazam products. Yeah, so there was, there was we a... We were waiting on apparition for a while weren't we yeah so we were waiting on apparition due to the due to the coins uh that roy cooper's uh was doing i think he was waiting he got the held off coins. for the chinese coins uh and so so there was there were there was a delay uh so we apologize about that guys but they they, they we could do. no it was completely out of our hands it was completely out of peter's hands and it was completely out of roy cooper's hands uh to be honest with you but as soon as as Roy, uh, as uh, kept us up to date. We had no idea. Yeah. No one had any idea that that's what was going to happen. Yep. We thought we were going to have the order at the end of April, wasn't it? Yeah, something yeah. like that. Yeah, yeah for this for the second took. batch. Anyway, we got them out the same day. Yep. And now we believe that everybody's happy. Yeah, now every everyone's got, everybody's got their unit. Yeah, and and apparition, by the way, guys. If you don't have it, it is exceptional. It is a fantastic project. One thing that I do get asked uh, a lot, and I say me, it's normally Charlene that will get asked because Charlene is the uh, it, it answers all the emails and all the live chat. Uh, that's that's who predominantly you'll be talking to is is Charlene. Uh, is apparition the same? as the Mirage coin set and know the two independent products uh, and they both work independently as well. Uh, so yes, they both come with a wallet, with a coin purse, uh, but, the, but the coin purse is functioned differently for each one. Uh, but go and check Mirage coin set out and Apparition. Now I know that we've actually sold out again. Uh, so if you are interested in Apparition or the Mirage coin set, we will be getting more in, but please go to the Notify Me section in the, uh, on, the, on the product page, page yeah. uh, and then just fill in your details, because as soon as it comes in, 
uh, you'll get notified and you can go straight to the website and purchase it. Um, talking of that, in that order uh, was an, another fantastic product. Now, I'm not going to play the trailer. I'm going to play a performance of this uh, by Nick Lacopo uh, from uh, Penguin Magic. This is uh, Knock 'em Dead. Now, uh, the 25th anniversary edition. If you have not seen this, this is unbelievable. In fact, uh, when uh, Nick Lacopo saw this at uh, Blackpool Magic Convention this year, he purchased it for himself. Uh, I've got a quick performance of him uh, doing this. This is a absolute, it's gonna knock your socks off if you haven't seen it. So I will put that on right now. So, guys, that's Knock 'em Dead. If you don't have it, you should have it. It's absolutely killer. I, this. I'm sorry, I like how on the fly that looked and it was just dead. Yeah, he said. Relaxed. It was a relaxed <laughs> trick. Oh, just do whatever you want. I, I think that that was actually in the, maybe probably in the Penguin Studio. No, I thought that was at Blackpool. No, that, that wasn't filmed at Blackpool. He brought it oh. at Blackpool, but that was filmed, I think, uh, in the Penguin Studio or whatever. So that may have actually been for magicians, uh, even though I know that they have a lot of uh, uh, non-magicians there. Uh, so he, he loved it. But he, you're right, Charlene. He, the way, how relaxed it was... And it was just like you know you can do you can do whatever do, do whatever do you want basically uh, I and told you. yeah and <laughs> it, it's really really strong. We've got those here uh, now. I also want to thank uh, our good friend Damo who's joined us now. Damo, thank you very much. You've just purchased the Shelby wallet. Uh, your order is ready for collection as well, so you can add this, and you're more than welcome, buddy to come round and also pick that up uh, if you want. So flick us a message, preferably not, not now, because I know you drive pretty quick. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so, <laughs> so we'll get a knock at the door in a minute. So, uh, but yeah, so that's all ready for you, Damo. So let us know when you want to pop round and you're more than welcome and you can come check the kitchen out and have a beer. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> but knock them dead. If you don't have it, guys, it's definitely worth you uh, checking out on the website. Uh, we've got the Australian and New Zealand exclusive uh, for this and it really does knock them dead. Uh, we get asked questions. Oh, yeah, the question. What's the difference between this one and the original and one? The, and the original, that okay. So uh, that, to be honest with you, is he's update. I think he's added uh, a. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to give the tip the method. Uh, he's he's added more more routines. He's added. He's added. He's added stronger uh, and ends. Endings. So. This this is truly truly unbelievable. If you haven't seen it, you, you'd get seriously fooled by it. And the spectators honestly have absolutely zero. Uh, they've got nowhere to go. You've just seen uh, Nick uh, perform it, and he's just like he's so easy going. It's just like yeah, when you're when you're when you're done, you just stop whenever. You happy yeah. there? I like that. And, and, and the results there, like it's just killer. And it's uh, super easy, self-working pretty much. Don't know, no skill involved because the spectator has the cards in the hands the whole time. And again, as we all know, magic is a lot stronger when it's in their hands. When they have full control over it, it's, it seems so much more impossible. Mm -hmm. So that's a big, big tick in my eyes. 
knock them dead. We've only got a few left, so if you are interested, yeah, it's been grab very it. popular. So that was that was the second batch, was it? This no, this was the third batch. This was the third batch, yeah. and uh, we should be once these are gone. I know I've got to put an order through with Peter, so if you're watching Peter, uh, there'll be an order coming through uh, with you uh, and for more apparition and uh, mirage coins. So uh, that's knock them dead. That was really really good. Now, another uh, exclusive of ours is by our very good friend, uh, Chris Rawlings, and it is called... Predictable. A, predictable. Now, uh, I'm going to play the trailer for this. It's an out-of-this-world uh, presentation, uh, and then I'll go over a few things because we've had quite a few uh, questions about this, uh, and I'll address the main one. Uh, so, guys, this is Predictable by Chris Rawlings. That's really odd. I don't know how you knew that. That's mad. Freaked me out. <laughs> I believe that out of this world is the greatest card trick that we can perform. This is my version of it. We're going to play a strange version of this game, but you get to decide first. Do you want to be nice and positive and look for yes, or do you want to look for no? I'll go for yes then. You're going to go first. Mm -hmm. So if the answer for you is yes, just yep. pull this over towards you and put it right in front of you like this. Right. We'll take it in turn. So I'm going to look for no because you've chosen yes. But that was your choice and it's yeah. important you remember that. If I won the lottery, would I tell anybody? No. Truthfully, the answer is no, I wouldn't tell a single person. You'll go. We're going to go back and forth. Really answer as honestly as you can. Yep. Because no one's judging you. And the important thing is that if you answer personally, truly, honestly, yep. those are answers that I shouldn't know about you. Uh, because we don't know each other. Fair enough. Like yeah. You didn't even know you were going to be here. Well, no, yeah. <laughs> All right, okay. I couldn't know those things about you. Uh -huh. Unless maybe I did. Right. Or maybe I do. Because earlier, when I found this game, I knew that I would end up showing it to you, even though I don't know you. Right. And I had a feeling like you'd be positive and you'd choose to look for yes. So on the back of all of these, I wrote something. The ones you didn't want, I put no. The really strange thing is, the ones that you chose to keep, the ones that you answered for yourself. I mean, I had a feeling that you would be a snorer, or you would <laughs> recycle or gamble, or can you keep a secret? And I, yes, on the back of all of these. All right, that's pretty good. <laughs> I don't know what to say, to be honest. <laughs> I don't know how you knew that. No it's on the back way. of all of them. Freak me out. That's really odd. That's ridiculous. That's really yeah. odd. Felt like I was giving real thought into my answers and I didn't even know what I was going to choose. So based on what you've already picked out for me, it's bizarre. If you could summarise uh, what just happened, both of you, in like a sentence, what would you say? <laughs> <laughs> That's how I felt. <laughs> So guys, that is predictable. Now, uh, this is extremely good. As I say, it's an out, it's an out, uh, it's an out of this world effect, but is very, very personable. Uh, instead of just separating red cards and black cards, uh, you get them, and they genuinely have a free choice. Now, the main question uh, that we've received over this product. And that is, does it have to be even? So with the uh, with a pack of cards, you'd have to split them up into roughly even piles. Now that's 
you don't have to do that with this. The method's very, very clever. I believe it's a, he's utilizing a part of a method uh, originally credited to John Bannon. Uh, extremely good. Chris has done an exceptional job. So we've got the exclusive on this uh, at Global Magic Shop here in Australia and New Zealand. So if you want one, uh, we've got them here uh, shipping today uh, as well. One thing that we will bring up is uh, we've had uh, uh, somebody <laughs> email us uh, and when they received the product, uh, they said, oh, we, I actually purchased uh, predictable and uh, not table talk, uh, which is what it says on this packaging. Uh, table talk is the box that this comes in. The effect is predictable. Uh, obviously, if you had predictable wrote on there, uh, that may indicate uh, somebody might want to Google and actually uh, find out how this effect is done or where they can purchase it from. So table talk is just, it's just closed questions to uh, the open doors table talk. So they're just like little cards like you've just seen. It's like extremely like good. a game or something. Yeah, that at the end... Or you, if you've got it on your shelf yeah. in the house, yeah. you've got people coming over and you can just pull it off the shelf and say, I've got a bit of a game for you. Yeah, that's exactly right. And, and actually talking about that, uh, even though this is a professional effect, uh, it's probably not going to be a walk around uh, gigging situation but when you're sitting down or when you're at a table in a, uh, pub. in a pub wherever you can be obviously out working professionally it's just not a roving trick mm -hmm. I, I would suggest really uh, just due to the time uh, that you go through the cards they've got to make decisions and things like that don't get me wrong is this is this is a fantastic effect and we're super proud to have it but i just don't think it's a roving style effect you could make it work but i don't think it is i think you just need a little bit more time with the spectator but you're luring them in where they are literally making all these decisions they're thinking about it and you're getting them to speed up and go okay now you're thinking about them let's let's the moment you see it i want you to just make the decision snap uh, as if it's your instinct and they get quicker and quicker and quicker and uh, sure enough, when you show the backs of the cards, that's when they realized that their intuition uh, has separated uh, the yes and no's. It, it, it really is a fantastic effect. Uh, Chris, as always, he, he produces a fantastic product. The teaching on it's excellent uh, and it's really, really good. And it's very, very, it's a very personal effect. Uh, I think it's fantastic. So they are here, that is uh, predictable table talk so <laughs> getting confused getting, i am getting confused <laughs> so uh so i believe that we've now <laughs> sold out of all of the shelby wallets guys so thank you very much uh for jumping on uh now we will be getting more in stock uh in next week's delivery so i will put the information on there so if you are interested uh, it will give you the dispatch date, which will be next next Wednesday, next Tuesday or next Wednesday. Uh, it'll be shipped straight out to you. Uh, but that is fantastic. The Shelby Wallet, everything that you see is great. Uh, predictable, so, so good. And I love Knock 'em Dead. Knock 'em Dead, you should have it, guys. It's really, really fantastic. Uh, another exclusive uh, that we've got is, uh, now this is, this is a remake uh, of an original uh, product, but in my opinion, this has been made a lot better. And that is uh, Mystery Solved uh, 2.0. So this has been produced by TCC. And what this is, is it's a, uh, uh, it's a card to box. It's, so it's, it's, it's an impossible location uh, where a card is select. You can use a card. You could also use a billet, by the way. Uh, and then uh, this transparent box has been on the table the whole time with a card in there uh, that's folded. Of course, you then go through a routine potentially where you have a card selected, uh, lost, uh, an ambitious style of routine, whatever it may be. And then eventually you tip the card out that's been on the box, the, uh, on the table the whole time into your hand and... That's your chosen card? That's your chosen card. Amazing. So what TCC did here, uh, so the original version was actually, the, the box was bigger. Uh, they have made it slightly smaller 
uh, and you can still use billets. You can still do all that kind of stuff that you could do with the original one. Uh, but this is slightly smaller and it is, in my opinion, uh, better. The method is, uh, is exactly the same. Uh, and it really is super, super clean. The, the transparent box at the end is you end, you, you end clean, basically. It's very, very good. Uh, very, oh, very not, good. With it being a clear box, that adds what you say, adds that, what do you say? Layer of impossibility. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so <laughs> <laughs> you always need a layer of impossibility. You've got to constantly layer, layer, <laughs> layer stuff. Um, I've, I've played around with most uh, of these of these style of boxes. It's the, like basically it's the Kennedy box. Um, and in fact, when uh, Kennedy released that years and years and years ago, I had that. I've worked with uh, Tommy Wonders uh, box. Uh, John Allen has a wonderful clear box. Uh, so did uh, Wayne Dobson, uh, 360, I think it was called. For me, um, the mystery box has probably been the the best solution uh, to them, and, and purely for the fact of I love John Allen's Paragon 3D. However, uh, if you if you're timing slightly out, it can be it, it won't have the same effect. Obviously, practice and practice and practice. But sometimes, if you if you don't do an effect for a little bit, and you go back into it, you work it in and then you go to a gig, you might just have that timing slightly out. You won't have the problem with Mystery Solved. It's exactly 100% all the time, every time. Plus, the Mercury Fold that you do uh, doesn't need to be perfect with this, whereas like Paragon mm -hmm. 3D, it has, it has to be perfect. Uh, talking of that, we actually... Uh, as most of you are aware, obviously we've got the, we produce the Connoisseur range uh, and the Connoisseur range is all uh, bespoke card cutting uh, and gaffs and things like that, uh, that you can't just go and purchase uh, off the shelf. In fact, our some of the stuff that we do is uh, not only can it not be purchased, but obviously we do still have a line of Svengali decks and stripper decks, but they've been made in a far superior tolerance, uh, whereby uh, they're, they're exceptional. In fact, I've got a customer that only that called me up the other week, uh, and he was he wanted something producing because uh, we do that as well. Or we can produce goods. Uh, for you guys, uh, anything that you want, if you've got an idea, uh, we, we, we can make your dream a reality uh, with a pack of cards. So, uh, but he called me up and he, he honestly uh, applauded the way that uh, we treat our cards uh, and he was referring to our invisible deck uh, and also the mental photography deck. Uh, he, he said, I, I don't know what you treat them with, but they truly are exceptional. So uh, that's what, you know, uh, that, was, that was a fantastic thing for one of the customers purposely come out and he, and he got on the phone and he said, listen, John, I just want to applaud you and say you're doing a great job. Thank you very much. And I said, you need to write me a review. So there will be an honest review coming uh, from him very soon. Yeah, but those are the things that you need to hear as well. Yeah. It gives him... Gives him more motivation. Yeah, because, you know, sometimes, obviously, you guys purchase stuff, and we don't expect reviews all the time and things like that, but there is a lot of, there's a lot of years that have gone into putting, finally, this Connoisseur range together uh, with the equipment. Uh, like the, the equipment, honestly, is not cheap uh, to get proper gaff-making uh, and uh, gambling equipment to, to gaff cards in a professional way. Uh, and also the treatment processes as well. Uh, that's taken me years to find particular fluids and chemicals that we apply. They're not just necessarily something that you would you would be able to get easily. Uh, and enough ventilation when you do spray the chemicals, John. Yeah, that's, that's right. That's very important. That's very important. <laughs> there have been times where the ventilation I've maybe forgot Especially to turn. Especially when we've had a 40 degree day. Yeah, to turn the ventilation off. And uh, yeah, any case. <laughs> <laughs> so, Are we going to watch the trailer to that? 
Uh, I do have the trailer for Mystery Solved. Would you like to watch have it? Have you got it ready? I do, yeah. It just yeah. basically goes over really what we've gone over, but I'll explain it so you can actually see, because they do put a comparison side by side. But honestly, TCC have really done a fantastic job with this. So this is Mystery Solved 2.0 by David Penn and TCC. Launched at Blackpool 2023, this is Mystery Solved 2.0. So why have we got a 2.0 version? Well, as you'll see from the close-up shot, there's a big difference in the size. The original was made for a billet, for a lottery ticket, because I use this all the time in close-up and in my stage cabaret routine on live camera. But the new version is made especially for smaller billets or indeed playing cards. This one has been designed to fit exactly a folded card, so you can use it in your mystery card routines. It looks absolutely impossible. It is a genuine, clear box. The illusion is perfect. When you tip that billet out into your hands and hand that to the spectators, they're looking at the gimmick box, but it just looks totally clear totally impossible. That's Mystery Solved 2.0, launched at Blackpool 2023. Introducing Mystery Solved 2.0, the upgraded version of the incredible car to impossible location effect created by David Penn eight years ago. A transparent box containing a folded playing card is presented to the audience. They choose a card at random and sign it. And after a series of effects, the card disappears from the deck. You then pick up the transparent box and tip out the card. It turns out to be the audience signed signature card. The upgraded Mystery Soap 2.0 box is molded with every detail carefully considered and improved. It is completely transparent, exquisite, and was specially designed to fit a folded playing card perfect. Mystery Soap 2.0 can also be used with predictions and billets during your mentalism routines. Highly recommended by so many professional magicians all around the world. This is Mystery Soul 2.0. So, uh that is uh, Mystery Salt 2.0. Now, the reason why I brought up the Connoisseur range uh, was to tell you that obviously we sell uh, scored cards as well. So they're pre-scored to make your uh, Mercury you card fold. Mercury card fold. Yep. It's pretty phenomenal. I must have been doing it bad if you've seen no, it. No, I didn't <laughs> see it. That's the thing. I used, I used to, can you remember when I, when I had it? I used to have a bin. Uh, obviously, oh, like, yeah. uh, like when all right. So when 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 we all practice and we go in, and you really actually need to practice, uh, you, you can spend hours and hours and hours. And I have literally spent hours and hours working out. My hands aren't big, by the way, uh, but I needed to mask the uh, the, the fold. Uh, you the, the, there was you always fold one without a scored, can't you? But it's not. Or yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. You can score the make the, uh, the original one. Yeah. You don't you, you don't need it to be scored, and that's what I used to practice yeah, the whole I time. Remember. And I used to sit there with a basket with a bin essentially between my legs, uh, and I'd be watching magic, and and I'd just be folding, and I'd have a camera on me, yeah. and I'd be like, one, two, and then I'd and I'd go one, so I knew that that was number one, number two. However, I'd move on. Let's say number ten, I'd read. I'd actually adjust my fingers and hands to accommodate a different slightly different position and then i'd go again one two so i always knew so that whichever angle uh the camera was looking at I'd, I'd, i would find the best way for me to do it for my hands any case years and years and years go by of uh, pointless stuff like that really uh but we do sell to save you all of the aggro yeah, you score them now don't you? i pre-score them uh because it, to be honest with you i can i can i can either give them a a, a scored deck uh, a choice from a full scored deck or i can put it in there and and and, and force the card if i wanted to 
um, and then they, they sign the card. The, you can't tell on the faces that it's been scored. It's just very minimal on the back. Uh, you'd be hard pressed to see it, to be honest with you. But in the right light, if you went like this, you could see a slight mark, but it'd be, it, it's, it's nothing. No one's looking for that, though, are Absolutely they? not, no. And, and, and I've no never been caught. person wouldn't even fathom that that would be a thing. No, yeah, it's, it's not a thing. You're right. I'm making it a thing right now, but you're right. It's not a thing. <laughs> so you see what magicians do? We make things out of nothing. We don't need to do, you know? So, uh, but, these, uh, but these are the things that go through our weird, wonderful heads. Yeah. But we do sell this, this, this scored version. The reason why I brought them is, out as well is because I was using uh, Paragon 3D and it needed to be perfect. However, since getting these in, <clears throat> I've gone back to... Uh, mystery solved to be honest with you uh, and now uh, I, I just, just I just make a record for it yeah I love it it's great because it's you know it's been in there it's been on the table the whole time this is what this is what they can't get to grips with uh, and because it's a clear box when you tip it out everything is is clear now you can't hand the box out for examination but you won't need to there's never any reason for you for, for the spectator to even, it's a clear box basically, so they can see straight through it. So they know that nothing is untoward with it, uh, but you can't you can't hand it out. That's for true transparency. But you wouldn't need to, uh, and an ability. You don't need to because they can see through it. Yeah, uh, a lottery prediction. You can do a lottery prediction. Uh, you can do anything with billets. So you can. It's it's obviously, guys. It's a switching device. Uh, that's what it is, but it's extremely, extremely good. And these are also in our uh, sale. Are they? Yep. Yeah. So guys, <laughs> like, grab a bargain. You, you can grab a bargain, and it really is fantastic. You can they, you can use that as a stage performance easily because that's what David Penn was just doing. Yeah. So this. So yeah. So it's good for close up, stage, roving. Whatever, whatever situation you find yourself in, this is good. And you can also uh, make it so you get quite a few gimmicks with this. Don't freak out because uh, if you're familiar with the workings, you'll know that it's, when I say gimmick, it's, it's nothing to worry about. But basically you can, you can have a, a you, it's interchangeable. So if you didn't want uh, to do a playing card and you wanted to do a billet or a uh, or a lottery you can interchange it so depending on your situation so for walk around you might want the card but if you do parlor you might want a billet for stage you might want a lottery prediction like I don't know but it, it, what I'm saying is is you can interchange it's it's really good I'm so glad to have this in uh, because it went off one for yourself uh, I've got I've, I've put one aside for myself yeah so. of course I've actually got one open and used it because <laughs> I've been playing with it uh, so it's really really good Charlie's like I knew it I knew it <laughs> I'm like a kid in a candy shop and then when when the, when the kids say where's where's dad where's dad I goes he's in, he's in the magic room playing magic mom he doesn't play magic he's not playing he's an adult <laughs> And he's just said, I've been playing with this. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, it's serious though. I mean, you've got to take it serious. It's like, if there's anyone walked in, we've got, I've got mirrors and cameras and all these weird, wonderful things set up for me to practice and, uh, and, and make sure that it's right. But this is, this is really good. If you don't have it uh, and you're after this kind of uh, impossible location, uh, you, you'd be hard pressed to go past Mystery Solve 2.0. It's definitely worth your attention and it's been made very, very well. Um, I think there's, because I know that Mystery Solve, the original one, went off the market for a long, long time and obviously TCC have struck a deal with David Penn. With his blessing, uh, TCC have produced it and with We've all. Got that exclusive, by the way. Yeah, yeah, this yeah. is an Australian and New Zealand to exclusive us. to Global Magic Shop. Uh, so yeah, so grab it while you can. And as I say, they, this is one of the one of the many products that we've uh, put on 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 sale. So uh, end of financial tax year sale. Are you going to show everybody your handcuffs now, John? My handcuffs. So this come in, and I thought oh, I, I thought Fox's we'll handcuffs. Fox's handcuffs uh, by Wayne Fox, not oh. me, Jonathan Fox. Oh. Mm, I know. 
Uh, I'll tell you a funny story in a minute, actually, about uh, uh, about about a product no, that we. Don't tell them about your handcuffs, John. Your real handcuffs. My real handcuffs. <laughs> the the real handcuffs. Uh, so this is uh, Fox's handcuffs by Wayne Fox. Now, what this is is his take to the crazy man's handcuffs, um, and he's he, essentially he's added a a gimmick uh, with this bring it into play i'm going to play the trailer and then we'll go over it because i think this has been overlooked now i know for a fact because i've just checked murphy's that this is sold out at murphy's now we do have these in stock uh, and these will these are ready to ship as well so let me find this one foxy's handcuffs by wayne fox and then we'll get into it uh, and we'll talk about it so here it is uh, once when they cross it makes a square the crazy man's handcuffs has long been a favorite illusion for many magicians all over the world from the other world it's just two elastic bands Talk about Pat Small plays big. But with the Crazy Mans, it was all about how you unlink the bands and never about watching them link. Until now. For several years, I've been working on a slow motion melt through of two elastic bands to create the perfect illusion. You saw right, but this isn't just eye candy for the camera. Watch it working at a real event. Right, if, if I was to take these off of my fingers, they'd fly right across. Yeah, yeah, anyway, yeah. Watch it. So, index finger and thumb. You do the same. And they pop a car. <laughs> no way. Right. 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 And again. Supplied with the special gimmick and this 40 minute tutorial, I teach you how you can perform this incredible illusion in all situations, even surrounded. I include bonus material on how to present this effect on all your social media videos. And you'll be pleased to know that after just a few minutes, you'll realize that the gimmick practically does most of the work for you. I'm Wayne Fox. Get ready to blow some minds because this is Fox's Handcuffs. Oh my God! Wow. So guys, that is uh, Foxy's Handcuffs by Wayne Fox. So, uh, as he said, 40 minute in uh, tutorial, it goes over everything that you need. So just to be clear here, not only is this a good for virtual, but this is a real world worker. As you've seen, there's plenty of footage there of, uh, of Wayne uh, performing yeah, that. Doing in, it in bars. Yeah, doing it in bars. He was obviously at, at paid gigs uh, working it. Oh, with, with all of like Wayne stuff, David Penn stuff, it's all thoroughly worked in. That's, you know, they've got an amazing review show and, uh, it they 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 know that the stuff has to be worked in and that's exactly what you get so uh with this product it's a well worked in well thought of product uh the gimmick is very very well made uh and more to the point is you're probably going to ask yourself why do you need uh, a gimmick essentially for the crazy man's handcuffs and the honest answer is you don't however with this gimmick will allow you to do some amazing slow-mo uh, links and unlinks that to the eye is really, really confusing, uh, which you cannot do 
to be clear with any of the other versions Hanson Chen's got a an amazing uh, version Crazy Sam's handcuffs that is amazing to do with normal elastic bands if you were to add this gimmick with that you'd be it, it'd be really really amazing I think this is a really fantastic product if you've got a use for it uh, and you like performing rubber band magic don't go, don't go past this because the slow-mo of the link and unlink is ridiculous. It really is super, super clean. So you don't need it to perform the crazy man's handcuffs, but I think that this is a valid addition to that line uh, that you can't do with normal with normal hand, uh, rubber bands, okay? So the gimmick will allow you to normal do things. Handcuffs. Yeah, with normal can't handcuffs. Can't do with normal handcuffs. <laughs> So, uh, <laughs> you know, if you're interested, we've got these here, uh, and, and these are fantastic. I think this is also in the, in the well, sale, I've just realised. But That's in the sale as well? Yeah, and Murphy's are sold out of these, so most magic shops are probably going to be sold out <laughs> worldwide. My favourite rubber band trick is Hard Stretch by... Um, Roman, Roman Armstrong. Armstrong. Yep, yeah, uh, Roman Armstrong. Uh, that's in the sale as oh. well, Hard Stretch. Uh, that's killer. If you haven't seen Hard Stretch, guys, make sure head over to the to the website. It's an Alakazam product uh, by uh, Roman Armstrong, produced by uh, Alakazam. That gimmick is exceptionally well made as well. Uh, the, it's they're both fantastic, fantastic products. Foxy's handcuffs, Hard Stretch, brilliant. But with this, do you need it? That's up to you. But if you want the super slow-mo visual, you can only do that uh, and get that look with, with this product. Uh, so I think it's great. It's definitely got a place uh, in the crazy man's handcuffs routine. And the handling, and he's right, after a few minutes of playing with it, you'll, you'll have it down pretty easily. And you really make it look like it's a, it's a rubber band. <laughs> it's really well made. So that is Foxy's handcuffs. Uh, and there we go. I think that's pretty much. Yeah, we nearly... haven't told them the major, the major news. Oh yes. Yeah. So, so we had uh, we had a customer call up uh, this morning, and we were having John's a good, famous, good, a good chin wag, and uh, it would. He yeah, says, it's, it's John, you're finally famous." And we're like, "What? What, what are you? What are you talking about?" <laughs> and, and he's like, uh, "The uh, he goes, what was, what was what was that product you you you, you released? You know the." Uh, the flighty thing, and I said, oh, Orbit. He goes, that's the one. <laughs> I said, what are you on about? And he goes, are oh, you famous with Orbit? I said, what do you mean? He goes, we're on the knockoff site. We're on the Chinese knockoff site. <laughs> <laughs> so, so I went through, Horrible. Uh, he, he sent Same me. video and everything. Yeah, 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 but you, you can't get the gimmick. But if you want the instructions, it's two dollars ninety nine. But you don't get the gimmick. Uh, so if you want the instructions for Mars, we'll give it to you for free. <laughs> yeah, don't 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 be going to uh, and supporting the knockoffs. So we did find it uh, quite funny, and I do think it's funny, uh, really. But yeah, he's, he's like you're famous, and we couldn't understand why. And he goes, if the if the Chinese are knocking you off, mate, if the if they're ripping your product off, you know you you know you're doing something it. You right. Know you've made it. And so we had it. Yeah. In the elite club, now. yeah, yeah, uh, but uh, but seriously, guys, please support the the, the, the creators. Uh, I mean, it's ridiculous. I actually did go onto this this site. I'm not going to name the site, uh, but you could literally go on, and, and and it was ridiculous. They were selling all the instructions, not none of the products, uh, for for ridiculously low sums, uh, and they even had, uh, which was ironic. Uh, on the paperwork that said the uh, the instructions that come with this have our watermark on there uh, for what was it what was it worded Charlene it was know, it was basically saying so to, pre to, to, to prevent copyright yeah. and I'm like they've taken it straight from us <laughs> like, yeah. so uh, yeah they it's haven't, they haven't even bothered to no 
Uh, and, we, and guys, we've, 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 all, we've also put Orbit on sale. So if you do want it, uh, then uh, please uh, head over to Global Magic Shop. So all the sales stuff I'll put back on the homepage. So you'll, you'll go to the homepage underneath Trending Now, which, by the way, all the Trending Now stuff is, is, the, is a snapshot of exactly the stuff that you guys are actually buying right now. Uh, so that's a live thing and that, that gets updated. Uh, remember to check out our featured product section as well. But I will put that uh, sale page on there and it will be below the, uh, the trending now. Um, so I think I think we've spoken about quite a lot. We've yeah. caught up on quite a lot of magic. I appreciate that there's heaps more magic to talk about. We will be back in two weeks' time, uh, Monday in two weeks. Uh, could you just find out what the data stock is? Because I actually did not uh, preempt because I was rushing around with this new software. So I hope, by the, the way, tenth. the 10th, Monday the 10th, just make sure that, by the way, guys, that you, uh, you you like and comment on our on all our socials. So you'll be watching this on a Facebook yeah, it's the 10th. now. And the reason why we do it in the middle of the day and not at night is because when the kids are yes are at school and the and the house is quiet. But I I know a lot of you would prefer it to be in the evening. But now now our children are getting older. We have soccer, martial arts, swimming. The you know the 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 usual the usual and we're stuff. We're just not home anymore. No, we're not. And uh, <laughs> but that's that's really good. They actually had a dress up day today. Yeah. Uh, Bradley went as his hero. Would turn out to be David Beckham. And uh, even though he wears a David Copperfield T-shirt twenty four seven, yeah, basketball, uh, basketball. Uh, but he he went as his idol, which was David Beckham, and. Ethan went as uh, what he wants to be when he grows up, which is... An astronaut. An astronaut, of course. Who doesn't want to be an astronaut? So... Uh, By the time he's older, they probably will be doing all those trips to the moon. Yeah, yeah. Space. That's probably very true. So he's probably <laughs> relevant. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Nowadays. Yeah. 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 Growing, growing fast. Guys, uh, please uh, make sure you like and subscribe on our YouTube channel, on all our socials. And by the way, when these go live on uh, Facebook and things like that, ne next time I will be streaming to Facebook and YouTube uh, and probably a few other platforms. Uh, but today was just Facebook. But please make sure you like uh, and, and comment and share. Anytime we go live, it's much appreciated, guys, if you can actually share that content uh, with other magicians and friends that are interested in magic, because it's just a little, it's just a little catch up. I really appreciate everybody joining us on today's live. It is much appreciated. As Charlene said, it is a random time of the day, but it, it really does suit us. And remember, you can watch it back. So I'm hoping to upload this once I finish uh, to YouTube. So of course, you can watch it on YouTube. Uh, but guys, without further ado, I really appreciate uh, Charlene. Thank you very much thank you. Uh, for thank you, John. for doing this. Right. I'm all right. Always there huh. supporting. Yeah, it's uh, it, which is true. Always there. So Charlene is the backbone of Global Magic Shop. Uh, predominantly, I'm the face and the the guy that gets the magic. However, Charlene is is definitely behind the scenes, working non-stop. She was out sending orders literally ten minutes before. Uh, we we went live today, so uh, thank you, Charlene, for getting all those orders out to all our important and legendary customers out there. So we really do appreciate it. So guys, until next time, I don't have an outro, uh, so I've got to work out how to shut this down. But uh, until next time, I really do we'll appreciate. See you on the tenth. Yeah. See you in the tenth about one o'clock. One o'clock. Make sure that you uh, are. Uh, like our Facebook page and things like that because then you'll get notifications. You should get notifications when we go live. So until next time, until the 10th, please uh, take care and we will talk to you then. Sp speak to you soon, guys. Bye for now. Bye. Bye.